I'm CBS 46 meteorologist Fred Campagna. Here's what we're looking at for this Tuesday. Nice day, really. Sunshine, a few clouds, temperatures getting close to 80 at noontime, and then up into the mid-80s this afternoon. A southerly breeze, but not very muggy out there today. So enjoy the nice weather we have today. We have more decent weather in store for us through the middle to end of the work week, although there is an increasing risk of some pop-up showers and storms. And it will be a little more humid for us on Wednesday, 65 to 70 early in the day, mid to upper 80s in the afternoon. Starting to see a couple of showers or storms flare up in the afternoon, particularly as you get west of Atlanta. So watching uh, for that action, about a 20% risk of getting caught in a thunderstorm on Wednesday. The risk of that goes up a bit on Thursday and Friday, but they'll be pop up. They don't. It doesn't look like any widespread, uh, stronger, severe storms in the forecast for the next several days. We're watching what's going on in the tropics, and this is tropical depression number three. It formed last night, has winds of 35 miles per hour, so it's nearing tropical storm strength uh, and that may happen may develop into a tropical storm by later today or tomorrow. It would be called uh, Cristobal or will be called Cristobal when it happens. And if it happens before Friday, it'll be the earliest that we've had three named storms on record in the Atlantic Basin. This one, stationary for now down in the Bay of Campeche. Eventually, though, it'll start to move to the north, and it could threaten particularly the Louisiana or Texas coastline at some point over the weekend or early next week. Too early to say exactly if it'll have any impact at all here in North Georgia. Could end up with some showers from what's left of it, uh, depending on where it goes. But those scattered showers and storms are possible Thursday, Friday, unrelated, of course, to that tropical system. Temperatures in the mid and upper 80s as we head through the end of the work week and into the weekend.